Hey, this is Dario from Classics Labs, and today we are going to see how to create a tenor control plane and try to understand also how a control plane, a tenor control plane in Kamaji is made of. So, I already have this manifest, and keep in mind that I'm using the manifest that you can retrieve from the Kamaji GitHub repository, but it's pretty straightforward as you can see here. So, we can specify a name, uh, the replicas of the deployment, how the service should be exposed the Kubernetes version and the cgroup FS driver, uh, systemd, you can pick up from systemd or cgroup FS, how the control plane should be exposed. And then we have also the section for the add-ons. So essentially when we have the control plane created automatically, we are going to have coordinate SQ proxy and connectivity deployed there. So now what you can do is to change uh, this, posi this position of my terminal and I'm going to watch for pods, service, config map and secrets events. So what I need to do is to apply this manifest. So turn on control plane YAML. And you can notice here that essentially Kamaji is creating all the required components to get it up and running. So we have the cube config, uh, the certificate uh, uh, account um, um, service, service account certificate the CA and so on and so forth. And you can see here that we have also the pods that are up and running. So in less than 20 seconds, you can notice here that the control plane is ready. So all these components are pretty important and are reconciled automatically by Kamaji. In fact, if I delete the deployment, Kubernetes 126 on my control plane, you can see here that a new set, a new replica set, since the deployment has been deleted, is going to be created. And the same applies also for the secrets. So what's going to happen if I delete the API server certificate? Uh, delete API server certificate. Of course, has been deleted, but a new one has been created. And since we have a different certificate, we are spinning up a new version of the tenant control plane. So in a nutshell, essentially, it's like having the control plane deployed as a sort of an application and Kamaji is taking care of all the complexity for the required components and also the reconciliation of the required resources. And that's all. Thanks for watching.